You guys, what are you doing tomorrow night? Oh, well, let me see. I believe I'm, yes, falling asleep in front of the TV. <laughs> well, my agent hooked me up with six tickets to a great play. I could fall asleep in a play. What is it? Well, it's a one-woman play called Why Don't You Like Me? A Bitter Woman's Journey Through Life. Oh. <laughs> that sounds interesting. Yeah, that does sound interesting. I mean, to listen to a woman complain for two hours, I don't think it gets better. <laughs> We can drive, we can vote, we can work. What more do these broads want? Well, you guys are gonna have a great time, I promise. What? H how come you don't have to go? Oh, well, I wish I could, but I just found out that I have to be at work really early the next day, so I can't go. But, you know, take the extra ticket and invite whoever you want. Ooh, let's see, who do I hate? <laughs> oh, sorry. Oops, sorry. Okay. Hey, oh, gosh, go. okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Do you think it's possible um, for two friends to, to fool around and, and not have it be a big deal? <laughs> no, I don't think that ever works. Why? No reason. No, no. Rachel, yeah. Who do you want to fool around with? Nobody! Forget it! Maybe? <laughs> you can't. Why? Come on. Okay, seriously, I did not understand a word you just said. In the hall. Okay. around with Joey? Yeah, you know what? Ever since I had that dream about him, I can't get it out of my head. I mean, what's the big deal? People do it all the time. Who? Who do you know that are friends that just fool around? Okay, off the top of my head, Don and Janet. Huh. Who are they? I, uh, I know them from work. Both of them? No, just one of them. Which one? I don't know. What were the names I just said? <laughs> No, Rachel, things could get incredibly complicated. All right, all right, all right, you're right. I won't do anything with Joey. I just thought it would be... Okay, so that'd be two cups of tarragon, one pound of baking soda, and one red onion. <laughs> what the hell are you cooking? Hi, Joey, it's Jan Rogers. Can't wait for your party tonight. Listen, I forgot your address. Can you give me a call? Thanks, bye. Hey! Hey! What's happening? Yeah. It's a real shame you can't make it to that one-woman show tonight. Oh, I'd love to, but I gotta get up so early the next day. You know, you know me. Work comes first. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Hi, Joey. It's Jan Rogers. Can't wait for your party tonight. <laughs> Stupid Jan Rogers! <laughs> you are having a party tonight? Kind of having a... A thing for the days of our lives, people. And you weren't going to tell us? How did you think you were going to get away with that? I do it every year. <laughs> you do that every year? I didn't have to tell you that. <sighs> God, I'm stupid than the Jan Rogers. <gasps> That's why you got us tickets to that play, to get rid of us. Yeah. Uh, and last year, is that why you sent us to that medieval times restaurant? Yeah. <gasps> and the year before that? when you set up that nighttime tour of that button factory? I can't believe you guys went for that one. I... <laughs> Joey, why wouldn't you invite us to your parties? All right, well, you're fine, okay? But everyone else acts like an idiot around famous people. Well, then so just invite me. <laughs> please, I was trying to be nice. You're the worst one. Oh, Joey, come on, please, please, let me come. I will behave, I promise. I will behave, please, please, please. Okay, please. okay, okay, fine, you can come. But don't tell anybody else. It's up on the roof at eight. 